Okay, so I'm gonna try to put you on my brain on how I, how I do the charts. How I try to make the charts make sense to real life and Tesla and all that. But right now I'm looking at Tesla because I love Tesla, right? Inside and out. And today is going crazy. It's going crazy. And I feel like I know why. I think it's all of the, the news around the FSD possibly going to China and going to like a Europe and stuff like that and the, the event and all the stuff like that. But anyway, I just believe in the company. I think it's going to be amazing. It's making sense to me, right? So this right here is like the year chart. And it's kind of like wherever I, whenever I, I get to go into the market, I, I start at looking at the year chart because I'm in uh, accumulation type mode. So I'm looking for like huge, huge moves down, down so I can buy the dip. Ooh, started selling right here. Look, look at this. This junk right here is like funny to me. All this, all this fail. Who was selling? Wow, it's crazy. I was trying to buy everything. Everything was trying to get bought. Just like these red and, and uh, green lines is a the MA crossover, the 50 and the 200, and this is the RSI. So I, this is like track, like the the buying activity and stuff like this. And this is kind of tracking the movement of where the stock is going. Hopefully that makes sense. So Tesla is doing some crazy things today. So it's open like right here. And that was all the way up here now. All right. It's just significant, you know, because of like the way that the stuff is happening in the world. And so I, so I got to go. And then so then from there, I just dive in a little bit. I started at like the three of the five, three of the five, three of the five. Th th I'm gonna start with a five. See what's that? So right now it's probably get be old, so it's probably gonna chill off for a little bit if you trade it, if you're doing like some other stuff. See, and then when I'm ready to buy, this is I start diving in like this to see where it's at. So if it's up here, I'm gonna just wait until because it's a lot of it's, it's a lot of buying going on right here. You know, right now in this minute, like right, right, right now. So. Uh, after that thing go down here is where I would look to buy it. Like if I was trying to, you know, cause the price is like getting the best price whenever you trade is just my goal. Like it don't matter what time I get in, I'm gonna just sit there. If I got time to trade, I'm gonna get in there and I'm gonna do this and look for like the best price to buy it for that day, no matter what. Cause I just want the best price cause I'm accumulating. And I'll watch this and drop. It might not, it, it might take forever. It might be like two or three hours. I, it's just like I've just been like I've just learned to build up some uh, some patience to get a good price because I've been burned so many times for getting a bad price. You know, getting it when it was up here, and they're like, "Oh snap, it's going up," and they only go up for like you know two or three percent, then it drop all the way down. And I'm like, "Oh my god." I made a mistake. I got a bad stock and then I panic sell and then I lose out on all the shares. That's retarded. It don't, you know, like all this stuff is starting to make sense. It's starting to click. So that's a five. And then I just kind of go and I, I look at, I like to look at the year to date stuff. Cause I don't want to start buying a stock and the stock is like going, like it's going on a, like a downtrend. And when you look at the year to date, you kind of can like see where it's like at. So. And that's kind of like where it's saying. And this right here where it crosses at is showing that it's it's trending to go to a on an upward trend. And this this buying action down here is, is is helping confirm that. And like what I know about the news and all the stuff like that. I don't know why I felt like to uh, get on here and spill this, but it was on my brain. <laughs> and uh, it's just a chart. I don't know. I, I like. I like looking at these charts, man. I like I, I value using the charts to invest so I can get the best price because it does make a huge difference. Yeet.